this. Guys, th th there's been drama in the Roblox community and we must discuss this. It's so urgent, but don't worry. I'm here to explain everything to my best of my abilities, which are pretty low, but it's fine. You probably clicked on this video because I mentioned TikTokers in the title, and I myself am not a TikToker, but I like to examine the strange world of Roblox TikTok, and that is what we'll be doing today because recently there's been a bit of confusing drama that is it really understandable that I would like to look into? Now this involves two pretty popular TikTok editors. Technically, they're not just TikTokers, they're also on YouTube. Okay, I don't know how to pronounce this. Z actually, I'm gonna do my research before I try to say her name. Also, do you guys like my background on Google? Isn't this so cute? Oh, <laughs> well, okay, I get to play this game. Hold on, I know this video is about something else, but l let me play this game real quick. <laughs> <laughs> I'm mentally fine. Xiaolong. Xiaolong? Xiaolong. Okay, I really hope I'm saying this right. If I'm not, we're blaming it on the translator. Xiaolong. I think it's Xiaolong? Xiaolong. Xiaolong? Xiaolong. Xiaolong? Xiaolong. <laughs> okay, okay, this drama has to do with Iconic and someone by the name of Xiaolong. Xiaolong. Again, I really hope I'm saying this right. If I'm not, feel free to cancel me and uh, yell at me in the comments. <laughs> this all started the other day when I was just scrolling through YouTube shorts and I came across this turning into the person who ruined my life. And I was like, okay, this is gonna be a meme, you know? She's just joking. <laughs> uh, but no, she just outright called out iconic. I still thought they were joking. I was holding on to a little bit of hope that they were joking about this, but all the comments are like so dead serious. Everyone's just debating in the comment section. And then there's this TikTok. There's plenty of these. Hold on guys. This is a wild ride. I need it to stop. I need everything to stop. And it's just them hugging. I'm so confused. Keep in mind, this is all Roblox, and usually people don't do beef over Roblox edits, so this is kind of new to me, but don't worry, there's more. I blocked her, and it's her blocking Iconic, like, on a TikTok of her shaking her booty. This is like Ash and I throwing hands and beefing with each other over the internet through us posting videos. All you know, tomorrow I could show up, post a video, and go, guys, Ash, I blocked her. We're no longer friends. She ruined my life. I just feel like that would be so immature of me to do. If there's ever a friendship problem on the internet, I feel like it should be handled behind closed doors and not for all of your fans to see because that's just gonna make it so much more complicated. If you are telling the whole internet that you blocked a certain person, they're gonna be really confused and uh, they might stop following that person. They might start hating on them. Like there are so many implications that come with publicly talking about personal drama, especially when you're at the size of how many subscribers does she have? Almost 2 million. But hold on, that's just Xiao Long. Xiao Long. Sorry, I probably said that wrong. I'm so sorry. We still have Iconic to talk about. There's this captivating edit titled Betrayed. Here we have her just chilling on a little dock and then out of nowhere, her best friend comes and pushes her off into the water. What is this? Again, I have to reiterate that this is a Roblox TikTok. Like, come on guys. I don't know what's happening behind the scenes. You know, I don't know if someone did something really horrible, which we'll get into later of the speculations on what people think caused this. But I just feel like it's kind of strange to make an edit about it because edits are usually very lighthearted, you know, hot Roblox dudes dancing in front of a camera, singing like la la lu lu lu, you know, with some after effects shaking and whatever, giving people seizures. So it's kind of strange that real problems are going into a Roblox edit. I understand wanting to get like your feelings out and uh, maybe it's a creative passion for them to let out how they feel via making a Roblox edit. It's just weird. It just rubs me the wrong way. I have to say though, this is a really nice looking animation. And then right after that edit was posted, there's another one just completely calling her out and making a baddie edit of her walk down the street calling her friend a little b-word um and then her friend is just crawling on the street at 
don't think I can live another day. This keeps me up at night. I'm trying to fall asleep over there, you know, peacefully, you know, just thinking about, oh, what am I gonna do tomorrow? You know, maybe I should take a walk. And then all of a sudden in my head, Roblox drama. It just floods my brain and I can't stop thinking about it all the time. <laughs> That's why I'm making this video because I'm just so confused. May I mention that Zhao Long, Xiao Long literally made the same exact edit, but who did it first? How can you tell who posted first? Literally the exact same edit dissing each other. But let's go through some of the comments. Now, for those who are confused why this is happening, just like myself, oh. according to this one comment, <laughs> not sure how reliable this is. For those who don't know, so basically Xiao started discriminating Fatma's race, religion, and so Fatma started making rumors about Xiao, and now they both hate each other, and both fan bases are confused. <laughs> Confused is a bit of an understatement, um, but yeah, I think that's what happened. I have no clue if that's just a rumor being spread around, but that's what all the comments say. And this is all a legend. I am in no way trying to accuse anybody, nor am I trying to take sides. I'm just talking about this from a third point of view. Okay, one more thing before I end the video, because I know I feel like I've just been rambling and rambling forever, and you guys are probably tired of that. But recently, uh, they both posted edits claiming that they are once again friends. <laughs> Iconic posted this ping pong one <laughs> of them playing ping pong and Xiao posted this saying we're friends again to them dancing you know vibing it out how TikTok should be so I guess they're good I really don't know I wouldn't be surprised by the time that I post this video that something new happened I'm currently filming this on the 16th of April I have no clue when this is gonna be posted so if anything new has happened that's why I haven't talked about it. This video is very random and it's kind of strange for me to be doing a commentary drama video that's kind of unlike myself. So let me know if you guys like these videos at all or if you find no interest in them or if I'm overstepping. Maybe I'm overstepping. Maybe I shouldn't be talking about this. So, um, yeah. <laughs> This was not meant to be hating on anyone and in no way am I trying to tell you to go attack people. That is not what I'm saying at all. Please be nice, respectful to everybody. We don't know what's really going on. Okay, this is just all Roblox edits. Anyways, I'm gonna stop rambling. Thank you all so much for watching today's video and I will see you guys next time I post, which hopefully won't be a drama video. <laughs> I love you all so much and I will see you all later. Bye my beautiful bubbles. The tea is very cold now because I talked about it all. So it's cold because it's no longer hot. Okay, bye. <laughs>